Hello my soccer universe. At the beginning of April I got an email from Kappa sale. Here's a 20% discount for being a value subscriber. Yes, I ordered last uh, year. I ordered from Kappa. I think I did before that as well. And wouldn't you know it, I had a Kappa jersey on my radar for getting this season. More to complete a little bit more my Serie A collection than it being such an outstanding jersey. However, I thought this was more for May, but you know, 20% discount that puts the jersey from 50 to 40. Yes, I did not get the player version this time, time around because I had already spent some money and yeah. I was going back and forth. I said, nah, this is too good of a chance. I probably will not get it much cheaper at the end of season sales either. I also saw that my sizes were running rather low. So there's your chance. There's your chance. It arrived with some trouble. There was one delivery attempt when I was at home, but I could not be found. And there was a notification left that was never left. Sometimes I really don't understand deliveries. I know they're stressed people and they want to and I know we're not that easy to find but still uh, at least Let's be a little bit more truthful. Fortunately, they got a better driver and it arrived then a day late Which sucked a lot because I could have used it in a Serie A review, but you know there you go Let's open this up. It's a Serie A team. It's one of the classic Serie A teams. I will even say uh, I'm not sure if Fallen Giant is pushing it a little a little bit, but uh, they are a giant of the Italian game if you look over in history. And it's actually a sad state that I don't have any of their jerseys yet. So there you go. I like also that they're shipping now in this paper bag. Uh, it's not in a plastic bag. Uh, by the way, I also got free shipping on this one. And before I pull it out, there was also the question then. They had only my size, I know for couple for the regular shirts is an XXL. You know, Italian sizes, you have to size up more. Uh, but they had only XL and triple XL. And then they give you the measurements and I'm going back and forth, you know, uh, XL fits, should fit me right here, but with my, I don't want to say I have a big belly, but you know, with my belly, I should go rather go for the other one. So back and forth, I went for the triple XL option. I like my jerseys a little bit looser, as you can tell from this Fiorentina jersey that I ordered last year. The only sucker, of course, is this was it was supposed to be a May purchase, but take it as for 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 what it is. It's it's quite a nice jersey, I gotta say. I'm, I'm I'm pleased with this one. One, two, three. Genoa, the current jersey. They recently got promoted and are doing quite well. They will not get relegated get, 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 get again. It's, as I said, it's not the tight fitting version, uh, which means that the crest here, although I'm not sure if that's uh, general, I mean, this one is a silicon crest. I think on the Palermo jersey that I did not have to have, it was also silicon crest. This one is a uh, cloth, which I, honestly I prefer. I know it's heavier, but I, I, I prefer a cloth crest. Uh, with the slightly updated logo, but it's a classic logo. Genoa, of course, being the oldest team in Italy. And I think of the first 10 championships, they won eight. Uh, I think they are on nine or something like that. That's why they don't have a star, but they have a huge amount of number. And as, as the oldest club, thing is, it was only in prehistory. Uh, it's a classic half half design. And it has this really nice pattern in there. I think this should be the C which actually makes it also quite nice. It's also without sponsor. And then on the back it says Dall'inizio per sempre. It's 130 years. Yes, and the 130 year jersey. Uh, if there's another discount coming, that golden one I might go for as well. But let's see. So from the beginning for always 130 years old, the oldest team in Italy. Uh, interestingly enough, the crest is cloth, but the Uomini logo, that's silicon. Weird. Let's hang it up. So there it is, Genoa with the classic half half design. And what I really like is just look at the sleeves. On the blue side, there's a red sleeve. However, on the back, the sleeve is blue because in the back it's red as well. So from the front and the back, it looks exactly the same. And this is how a half half jersey should, should be not have, let's say, a red jersey and then have just a blue stripe down there, uh, as we have seen so often. So this makes it really, really stand out for me too teeny tiny minor 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 complaint the half half look is slightly broken 
here on the collar. Here on the collar. It is slightly broken because there's the, the red is a little bit thinner. But I'm not gonna, gonna complain. It's a beautiful jersey and uh, to have it without sponsor makes it even better. And I, I, I actually really like the C pattern on there. Genoa being of course a major seafaring power in the Middle Ages and you know the harbor still one of the one of the most important if not the most important in Italy. So there you go. Really really pleased with this one. This is a beautiful jersey. Gotta say. I, I, I like you know um, Cagliari has a very similar look um, but I think Jan Jan has a slightly lighter red which makes it probably stand out as well. And let's see which other, if there will be another Genoa jersey coming. I think Genoa had had some really nice jerseys over the past few years and it's actually a shame that this is my first one. There were some special jer uh, jerseys in, in, in there. I remember a grey one, then I remember one with a cross in white on, on front. It's always the color stripe across the chest. It's always something nice to have. So there you go. Any case, let me know what you think about this jer jersey. Was it a good buy? I paid 40 euros, free shipping. I'm not complaining for a brand new jersey. In any case, uh, always size up for Kappa as well. Even for these uh, that are not tight fitting because Italian sizes run small. Any case, give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Talk to you soon about more things in my soccer universe. Bye. Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you may enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the little bell icon so you get notified whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day. Bye.